Okay, hi everybody. Thanks for coming today. I trust that you all got the agenda. And uh, if we could all, you know, let's have some ground rules because our meeting in the spring wasn't very effective and we voted and it was chaotic and let's just really focus on what we're going to do with this technology money because the district's opened it up so that we can make a, you know, some changes to how we did our budget. All right, so um, as you know, we have that $300 per student and uh, we need to go back to the notion of iPads or the PCs. All right, and I know there were different issues. Um, Kevin, do you want to start out? If you can, you were saying that you wanted to speak about what the issues were. Well, I felt like that we needed to, I felt we had to go either all or nothing. We should either go with the, I, I know we don't have enough money for iPads for everybody, so mm -hmm. we can have either all iPads where we share them or that we have to go with PCs. Okay, so one or the other. Okay, Ms. Scotty? I think we should go maybe approximately half and half because I, I was all gun ho for the iPads uh, at the last meeting, but I took into account what John said and I was digesting it and he made a good point about PCs being a big part of the business world, so I think we should go about half and half. Okay, um, so we have an all or nothing or a half and half purchase. Okay, all right. Um, last time, Paul, you were really set on the iPads. Have you had any time to reflect on that? I still think they're the best option, but I've considered what Mr. Perrylot said before and just what Scotty was saying, and I am also open, open to having a combination of both. All right, a little bit to make our money stretch further. Would that be the reason? Mm -hmm. Okay. This okay, I'm, I'm, John? I'm kind of unsure now, not as sure as I was, uh, because I've been thinking that uh, maybe we ought to buy the equipment based on the software that we need. And uh, so if it's an Apple that has the software, we buy the Apple. If it's a PC that has the software we need, we buy a PC. But I can go either way. All right. Lindsay. I think we definitely need to stick with the iPad decision, the original decision. Okay. And Shireen? Well, I've had a chance to talk to some of the other teachers and the students as well, and they like the iPad idea. Um, so I'm kind of leaning towards the iPad myself. Just the iPads and not, to be clear? Yeah, I think so. Okay, just the iPads. All right, so the benefit from what I'm hearing and from our last meeting, the benefit of doing some iPads and some PCs would be because we could stretch our money farther and we'd have the kids sharing. We could have some kids with iPads or teachers and we could share and we could purchase more PCs for the computer lab. So um, let's, let's reach a decision on this, is there anybody that could not live with uh, purchasing iPads and PCs? Is there anybody that could not live with that decision? Okay, then we're gonna do a little of both and we'll figure out budget-wise what we will purchase a little bit more of depending on our budget. Okay, I just wanna say before we go on to our next decision that let's keep these ground rules going, that it's really good when only one of us speaks at a time. It's even better when we're polite to each other and uh, we all put our cell phones away. That was really helpful. And next meetings, we'll make sure we get agendas out early like we did this time so you can add to the agenda. So Kevin, you're adding another item to the agenda, which is fine. We can put it under new business to decide then how are we going to actually send out the iPads and how they're going to be used and when are they going to be used as well as the PCs. Great. Okay, good. All right.